Never in the field of human conflict was so much owed by so many to so few. Well, they're, they're not going to talk to me. Hey no, guys, so what you see here in okay, Spain, so we had just uh, had our first round in Spain, and the nationalists um, were able to take no? Austria yeah. Navarra. They're no, from the Republicans. But down here in Andalusia, uh, 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 the, uh, the one infantry actually went up to Leon uh, Castile, well, we're never gonna uh, retreated. Either, right? And uh, we we'll were working on the We got a two. And Andalusia, we just had two militia down there for fun. And of course, they were defeated by the two and three. But it did change the Republicans' war plans. So ultimately, now, uh, not much is going on too much with uh, Spanish, but we do have. We do have uh, the two northwestern nice. territories under nationalist control, uh, and the Republicans own the rest of Spain. Uh, the Republican fleet is moved up here into C Zone 48, and the nationalists there are in C Zone 33. And just like, okay, guys. So no, Germany actually, ended up building a few subs, one. building a few up land to, units, and uh, also. Upgrading a so factory here in eastern Germany, and, in and they annexed Austria. Because we can they did roll for tech, and they were okay, able to get a wartime here. economy. To get the, uh, the Russians here. did a few small minor moves over here, but the major, like more important thing is they sent an infantry chance. down to Abyssinia. Comes to us, be great in that and the it's not French, too bad. big things they did, you, upgrade, or actually send an infantry here. The Spanish Civil War, actually the Americans, Americans did, and uh, down here the Americans also um, probably, um, uh, upgraded, uh, uh, or sent an infantry, sorry, to, to Abyssinia. Japanese upgraded a factory Japanese here, did some small here, minor right? movements <laughs> um, yeah, sure. into uh, okay. close to the Chinese border here in Manchuria, possibly looking at maybe conquering yeah. some of the uh, Chinese warlords. So, so that nice. is what they are currently doing right yeah. now, and France is turning. <laughs> We don't do it. Uh, I think this so guy's going to New Orleans. Up buying a mountain <laughs> there, and they yeah. moved a lot of their troops yeah, up to the continent. It should be in the American box here. Uh, and yeah. the Americans yeah. didn't do a yeah. lot. I know they upgraded yeah. a factory, but of course they can't do too much here. And this basically yeah, brings an end to the 1936 term. Oh, yes. um, yeah, just yeah, to recap uh, on Italy. Italy money, so. bought a transport, um, yeah. and actually, I actually place this transport in the wrong area because it has to be a place. What you doing? Actually, no, yeah, it has yep, to be in a place with a minor factory, or at least so a major factory, so it has to be placed in that season. Right? I did. Um, yeah. And, uh, that's why I have and then we also lend these four factories the, uh, and the Germans and Germans and 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 also lend the Dulo Wool infantry there to the Spanish Civil War. Oh, right, 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 yeah. We're not placing the Spanish Civil War in this video, we're just going to show you the war to the Spanish Civil War. We're not playing the Spanish Civil War expansion, but I just wanted to use that just for some fun. To show that so is an actual Spanish troop, okay. um, or, or uh, an Italian troop fighting for the Spanish. So that is it, guys. We're wrapped up in '36, and not much has happened as it would. Um, just minor things all around. So we'll see you in '37.